on your smartphone. We're following a developing story in New Haven tonight. Police searching for the person who shot and killed a store clerk in his family store. It happened on Tuesday afternoon on Ferry Street in Fairhaven. News 8's Jason Newton is live outside the store with the latest on that. Jason. And this time yesterday, police had four persons of interest who were in police custody. Now come to find out, police tell us that none of those four people had anything to do with yesterday's shooting, which means the killer is still out there on the loose. It's been a somber mood outside of the E&M smoke shop for pretty much the entire day today. A day later, the crime scene is gone, and in its place is a memorial for 21-year-old Muhannad Jawad, whose family owns that smoke shop. Police say that Jawad had several criminal cases is pending, including firearm theft, assault on a police officer, and also charges that he was dealing drugs. Police say that yesterday's murder inside the business was not a random act or a robbery, which strongly suggests that whoever killed Jawad specifically targeted him. For those reasons, city officials say they don't believe the public is in any danger right now. It's unfortunate these things happen, but we're an urban city, but we have the best police force, I think, in the United States. They're on it. Uh, I don't think people need to be afraid. This is really related to whatever is going on in that Pacific area with that Pacific person and uh, is not something that threatens the rest of the community. And police went on to tell us earlier this afternoon also that they are reviewing surveillance footage from the killing, but at this time they have not identified a suspect. If anyone has any information that can help in this investigation, you're asked to give police a call. That's the very latest live in New Haven tonight. Jason Newton, News 8.